Today I wanted to do a one hour long blind drawing. So I got a bandana, set my alarm for one hour, and I went to town. I just put a random assortment of markers and pens by my side, uh, a couple of different colors, didn't know what I was going to choose. And I just kind of wanted to do this as like a little exercise on kind of like letting go, um, trying not to be as much of a perfectionist in my day-to-day -day work as I typically am because um, it's not typically like a helpful thing so I just wanted to scribble that's pretty much it I just kind of grabbed some random pens and just started scribbling because I wasn't trying to draw anything like objective um, so I figured a, I don't know one hour is a long time to like try to remember what you already drew on the page and actually try to draw something that looks like something. So I was just kind of drawing random lines, just kind of random shapes, trying to figure out some like new shapes or whatever. And it's just, it's such a weird thing. I, like all the skill I have at drawing, it just seems to like go out of the window right when you start blind drawing because I don't know, it just feels so new and just so different than what you're used to. Because drawing is, I guess, I don't know, half in the hand, half in the eye, maybe. Because they really, you can't do it without both of them. <laughs> can't do it well. Pretty much like every drawing, every painting I make, I kind of want it to be like really good I want to typically want it to be super detailed and it's just definitely not helpful because it it kind of it keeps it keeps you in one piece at a time it keeps all your time and attention in that one thing when you could be just experimenting doing like a hundred different drawings but instead you're just trying to perfect like one thing that you already came up with but I feel like the more I, the more and more I do art the more I think it's just, it's kind of about the concept of each piece and it's just kind of about practicing. So like not every piece you do has to be perfect. Like feel free to share your art with the world even if you think it's not good. Like look at this piece right now. It's like not good. <laughs> like I wouldn't say this is good. Um, I guess I wouldn't say it's bad though for a blind drawing. I don't know. But I just want to start throwing my work out there because I've always just put my work out there if I think it's really good, but I'm just trying to let go of that whole perfectionism mindset that I've always had. Um, and this is, I guess this is what I get when I, uh, when I do that, but I think it's pretty good for the most part. I think I'm going to do another, I think my next video, it, it might be another one hour drawing, but I'll just do the same thing without a blindfold and I'll see what I can come up with see how I can revise this uh, mess of scribbles in another hour. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that one. And yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.